Yo, welcome back to the house where we talk new celebrities and hot topics. All right, so very quickly, let's go ahead and talk about this B. Scott article. Uh, it says exclusive explosive clips reveal role was Marlo Hampton and Candy Burris put Drew Sedora on blast in Portugal while filming season 15 for allegedly kissing Latoya Howard. Now, honestly, apparently, according to some sources, you know, Latoya Ali made an appearance and she came back to confront Drew on them kissing. Now, this is not old information. Or, excuse me, this is not new information, y'all. This is not new information because we found out that LaToya and Drew had, like, a little thing back in season 13 during the Dungeon reunion. Okay, so it's weird that this is, like, an exclusive or this is coming back up in season 15 that Candy and Marlo are basically confirming that Drew and LaToya had a thing because we already knew that they had a thing. Uh, let me go ahead and play this clip. Let's see. Yeah, I mean, something's going on. And we also had yeah. something going on as well, Drew. Excuse me? Mm. I said you cheated on your husband with me. We kissed. <laughs> Coming up. Okay, so that was season 13 at Reunion. The last time we saw Miss Latoya Ali, right? She basically let it be known. You cheated on your husband with me. We kissed. We had a thing. So that was that. And so they went to commercial break and Candy confirmed it. We kissed. <laughs> we never kissed. kissed, girl. That we was such a bold faced lie. Candy. Well, I never. Y'all did kiss. No, right. Didn't. Or she... What'd I say? You said you seen them kiss too. I've kissed a girl before. Me? I would not have to lie about that. You kissed her. I never kissed her. Okay, so that was Drew Sedora seemingly denying it, talking about some. I want y'all to show me the footages of me kissing Miss Latoya Howard. I think that's her name now. Uh, you know, and Candy basically let it be known. Yeah, y'all did kiss. Marlo confirmed it. I think in this new recording that we're going to hear in season 15, Marlo confirms it. Uh, Kenya believes it. They say Candy doesn't lie. So it is what it is. So I'm confused as to why this is like news. Like, why is this explosive? Why is this a storyline? Why was this big enough for, you know, Latoya Ali to get a day rate to make an appearance on the new season? We're all just a little bit confused at the situation. Is this one of the reasons why Roa is going down the drain? Is this one of the reasons why the folks stopped watching because they're regurgitating the same old damn storylines? Now, maybe they're tying in this story with one of the reasons why Drew and Ralph are now getting this divorce. Maybe that's the reason why they're bringing this back up because I guess at this point in time, we can say that LaToya and Drew had a thing. All right, all right, all right. We could also say that uh, Drew Sidora and Ty, Mimi's ex, they may have had a thing. So that's the second girl. But there's also been a man. Mr. Anthony, the assistant, came onto my platform and basically let it be known that uh, one of the producers by the name of Ashton, okay, I might get in trouble for this. Sorry, Roa. But Ashton, it's already out there. So listen, it's just me repeating the same old, same old. Uh, Ashton, who was Drew Sedora's producer, was apparently in love with this woman, Drew. Ashton, the producer, was in love with Drew Sedora. And kind of, from my understanding, Drew used his feelings to kind of position herself onto the show, right? And I don't know if she had feelings back. Uh, but apparently, you know, Ralph knew about it and all of those things. And I have the receipts. Because it was a producer on the show that she had came with. I'm just going to buy the spill the tea, okay? Family it was honey. a producer on the show. His name is Ashton, right? Ashton, this is so crazy to me, but Ashton was in love with Drew. Like, Ashton wanted to be with Drew. Ashton was another reason why Drew got on the show. Ashton was like her ears to like what was going on. Ashton, because you know, on Housewives, all the producers, they go to each other's houses and stuff like that. So Ashton was like that puppet always reporting to Drew about what everybody had going on. But Ashton really liked Drew. And let me tell you something. Her and Ralph are married, but I don't know what type of marriage that they have because Ralph knew that Ashton wanted Drew. And I told him that that night after I after the escapade at the Lanithia because I called him in the car. And I told Ralph that he needs to come get his woman before I get somebody to come whoop her ass. <sighs> 
I was about to call Tierra down here and a few of my other girls from Love and Hip Hop, and she was about to get it. You know, he used to be Drew Sedora's assistant. He was Sheree's assistant first, then Drew's assistant, and then that kind of blew up at last year's reunion. And now I believe he works for Sheree again. Maybe they don't work together, but they like this. Okay, they're real close. And allegedly, according to what I found out, I believe uh, Anthony, the assistant, introduced Sheree and Martel. Okay, just some sidebar tea. Uh, but with that being said, yes. So he would know better than anybody. Uh, you know, I don't care how y'all feel about Anthony, the assistant. I believe that he's telling the truth on Miss Drusadora. She had this producer in love with him. Okay, so not only was this man in love with sis, but she also had this alleged relationship with Ty and this alleged physical relationship with Latoya Ali. So what's really going on? Is Drew Sedora and all of her extramarital relationships, is this the reason for the divorce? Was it really Drew Sedora out here mixing and mingling outside of the marriage? Is that the reason why they were rushing to the uh, courthouse? I don't know. Y'all got to let me know how y'all feel about the situation. I gave y'all the receipts. Let's talk about it in the comments. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, and don't forget to create a great day.